Hello everyone, welcome back to Suikoden 3. So last episode we did some more some recruiting. Uh, we recruited a bunch of people. And we're here in X Xay Village. I'm here to get something from this item store. Yes, I know Gordon, I'm <laughs> not that very noble of you for you. <laughs> so if you check out the ra rarity here, you notice there's a rose brooch. You need this. You need this for someone. Uh, you need this to recruit someone. So I'm gonna buy it. I don't care how much it costs me. 97 fucking kidding me. <laughs> All right. So yeah, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm just taking that one because it's for to recruit someone in Finidel Zexai. So in the meantime, I'm gonna go back to my castle and I'm gonna grab Kenji to join my party. Yes, Kenji is actually a fighter himself. I think he's level 17. I think. Or 25. Either way, I'm getting someone. <laughs> Let's see. And I'm gonna remove Martha to, from my party. So I can grab uh, someone with the uh, appraisal ability, I should say. Hey, Sebastian. I'm gonna or organize my party. Ah, oh, Bell level 13, damn it. Kenji, are you kidding me? I thought, was level I thought he should be level 17, but I guess not. Oh, man, that sucks. Before we fight, let's do a warm up. Hell no. <laughs> Man, poor Martha. I feel bad for him. Treasure hunt. Kathy, you got trade in. Uh, I wonder. If maybe I should get. Yeah, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get Arthur instead of Muto. I was gonna pick Muto, but wait, wait, wait. wait. This. Oh, this is actually a plus for me because I can get some healing and appraisal. Okay, Mio, it is. All right. Now we gotta go. We gotta go to Zexan Forest. So you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and see that. All right, here we are in Zexan Forest, and uh, the reason it, there is a character that you can recruit in here, and it's the reason why I bring Mio with me. Well, other than she can heal me after battle, that is. Whoa! What is this? Vermiter. Okay, I think you can. I can just kill it easily. <laughs> Look at Kenji, dude. Oh wow, that was quick. I could have sworn it would take me forever, but nope. He just, she just kills it quickly. Thank God I have Mel to carry me over. I'm gonna pick some head blossom herbs. Nice. So the character is right here, up here, and you need a appraisal. It's not with an uh, with an appraisal skill in order to recruit this guy. His name is Goro and he's the guy who makes bath in for our castle. And actually in this game bath if you bring Goro as a support your health will automatically heal uh, fill, uh, full up. It's actually really good to have him for support. No, this isn't it. This. This? No, this isn't it either. This guy's bath are much quieter, yet stimulating in a regal way. Um... I say this guy's bath is like a womb. Warm, comfortable, and safe inside. Ah! Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, he's a weirdo. He's always into bath. Who are you? Um, how embarrassing. Why didn't you speak up if you were there? <laughs> uh, excuse me? I'm not going to get into it. I'm sorry, but I don't have time to deal with you now. I have to find the right wood for my bath. <laughs> A bath? Yeah, I, I'm going to build the most amazing bath and beat that guy. I think he's dead. 
I'll help you. Which I'm. Um, for some reason, I thought his dad was it would be Tetsu from Suikoden 2, but uh, it looks like it's not Tetsu. It's someone else's. Um, would you like me to help you? You'll help. Hmm. It looks like I found someone who can handle the work. You can help me. Yeah, which is Mio. <laughs> This is good, you helped me find the proper wood. Now, to build a better bath than he has. Only one problem, maybe you can help me. You need a place, I get it. Uh, yes? You're from Lake Castle, right? What if I built my bath there? Can you ask the castle for me? You can't ask the castle, the castle doesn't talk. <laughs> okay. Of course it's okay. Really? Thank you, I can have my, my very own bathhouse. I'll have a better place than that guy. No, our place sucks. And you're not paying me nearly fucking enough to go there. <laughs> so who is this guy you speak of? He's my rival. That guy builds the best baths. I hate to say it, but they're the most pleasurable in the world. The blissful feeling lulls you, lulls you to sleep. What the fuck, man? I can't outdo him without better better supplies and, and a bigger place. You're a weird guy, aren't you? But you watch. No, I won't watch. I don't, I don't want to watch it. <laughs> I'll make that guy. I'll make that guy fall asleep in my bed someday. His body and soul will be in ecstasy. Okay, you're weirding me out now. One day you'll see. <laughs> red flag. Red flag. Crimson flag, actually. <laughs> Goro has joined 108 stars. Yay. Even though he's a weirdo, but I'll... Oh, whatever. Take medicine B. Hooray. Alright, so next up, we're gonna go to Nord Cavern instead of uh, Vinaidel Zexai. Because I wanna get some money. And there is a chest boss in there. That Thomas can actually fight instead of you know coward like <laughs> it doesn't want to fight. So yeah, and since we have Mel and Kenji, it should be easy. I'm hoping Thomas gets some leveling here because that way, because in Final Del Zexide there's gonna be three characters. No wait, five characters that you can recruit, and three of them involves. Uh, one on one battle with someone. So I'm hoping he gets some leveling and I get some money to buy some gears for Thomas. Alright, let's go ahead and get in here and get inside the boss. I'll fight some random battles in here as well. Also, I think there's a dog here that you can recruit. Like a dog, uh, like Koroko. So yeah, I think I, there is a dog that you can adopt here. If I'm not mistaken. I think he's in some barrel here yeah no unless you have to recruit it but in order by in order like you have to recruit a certain dog and then this dog and then that dog i don't remember i never really completed it but just it's just whatever it's not really it's not a requirement for a true ending of the game or uh well this guy this game is automatically true ending but if you completed the 108 stars the destiny You'll get an extra uh, storyline, which actually really cool. So, and it's not it's not part of it. The what the fuck? <laughs> That's how Kenji attack. It's so weird. And since we have meal, we don't have to worry about wasting medicine. So yay. Damn, look at that. Experience. Alright, looks like we're gonna fight a lot here. I'm hoping.
I guess that's also one of the things that I don't like about uh, uh, that I, f I don't know, feels like we are playing this in this game. They don't have true. Uh, the game doesn't matter uh, how many stars you have. Uh, you'll get the true ending no matter what. The the only reason why you get the you do the 108 stars, it's the, you get the extra st story plot. I should say. <laughs> Kind of suck, you know. It's not like in Suikoden 2 where, or Suikoden 1 where if you get all of the characters, uh, a certain someone who die will be resurrected. <laughs> I guess in this game they don't care who dies. Like there's no way they're gonna bring back Lulu. <laughs> who wants Lulu back? Nobody. <laughs> Except Hugo. <laughs> Alright, let's just go down. Alright. So, okay, we actually get to fight purple creeper here. Uh, this is these are the enemies that you get uh, that you get the screw from. You miss Mel? How do you miss that? Wow. Oh great. Well, he's angry now. Kill him. Nice. Gotta love one. Let's see if the uh, HP is recoverable. Yep. I'm glad we have Mio. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and save here. And then I'm gonna actually level Thomas up more until level 20. Because I, I don't want to risk the boss, you know. Alright. So, we're back. Uh, I only got them to got him to level 18. Because I keep getting the purple creeper. I don't want... Uh, and they don't really give much experience. I want the banshee, but they never really pop up. So anyway, I don't care. Let's go ahead and fight the boss. That's the boss right there, weird looking. I think he's like a uh, the trickster, like the the one in Suikoden, the earlier Suikoden, Suikoden game where they pick a way, uh, like a card of elements and stuff like that. So yeah, it's like that. So this is, this is the first boss for him. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. So I'm gonna go ahead and use best effort because why not? <laughs> wow. You have a lot of good shit now. Too bad you need a lot of turn to use it. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and use Furious Blow. Why not? And Devil's Doll with her, to her from her. All right. I think he has. Oh wow! Stop chanting. Good job, boys. I mean, good job, boy and girl. <laughs> Now, the Furious Blow, I don't think it will hit Mel and... Oh, never mind, he's dead. Ah, that was easy. And that's Thomas' uh, celebration. I didn't get good experience at all, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. That was quick. And not a lot of money. Damn it. Uh, I got we get some good equipment at least. I know these guys are failure earn, so I don't need this. And this is the uh, bath thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Man, that was quick. I can't believe I killed that quick quickly. I'm gonna get some medicine bees with me. Replacing some of the medicine D. Oh wait, this is a doghouse, right? Since we have Koroku now, we can actually replace. He has a doghouse, and we can replace it uh, with something. I'm not gonna get rid of Rose Bruce and Pale Gate yet because I need that. Hmm, maybe I'll get rid of. Antitoxin. Yeah, why not? We ha we're not gonna fight anyone with uh, poison. Yeah, so I don't think we we'll have to worry about it. Oh, great, Cecil. You ha you'll have this. And. Well, I don't think you'll need any of this shit. Oh my god! You definitely need a new tunic. Kite shield, yes. Damage helm. Worn out helm. Jesus Christ. 
new rope. Uh, piccolo. You can have that. Feather earrings. Honestly, you need it more than she does. I'm hoping to have a appraisal there. Oh wait, wait. I do have an appraisal on the road. No, I can't. Fuck. Okay, so we need like 20,000 pots. Uh, to get it to buy a certain item for from a character that you need to recruit. So I'm gonna sell the old shit. Including the sunbeam, I guess. But yeah, that's pretty much it for North Cavern. I thought I would have a hard time. Guess not. <laughs> That was disappointing. So you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and see you guys in Vinai del Zexai. So later. All right. So here we are in Vinai del Zexai. We're gonna go ahead and start recruiting people again here. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> so do you remember the three musicians that were playing a song in the the like town center of uh, of the yeah, well, town center, I should say. Well, the baz... baz uh, fuck, I don't know how to say it. Anyway, we're gonna go to recruit them. So, as you can see... Did you see what what just happened? An old man just chased... Was chasing a kid. If that doesn't tell you what's wrong, I don't know what is. <laughs> Did someone just pass by? Yes, Thomas, a child abuser. <laughs> oh, God. Yep, this is the weird part of the game, to be honest. I don't know why they would, they would do this shit. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and save the, save the kid from the abuser. But first we need to talk to the girl. One of the, uh, the two, uh, two of the musicians, I should say. Where are they? There you are. I think it's Nay and Topo. Yeah, Nay. Is it Nee? Nay? I'm gonna call it Nay. Fuck it. Um, did you see a small child? Uh, I see a lot of child here, ma'am. What are you talking about? <laughs> a small child? A little girl dressed a bit strangely. You mean like you? <laughs> oh my, where could she have gone? I saw him. I saw her. <laughs> she was chasing by some weirdos. Alright, let's go ahead and help her. They're right here, actually. Ho ho ho! And who else but the child abuser himself, Gilliam. First you, you, you hit Melville, and now her? <laughs> ho ho ho, isn't this fun? No, it's not fun. You're chasing a little girl, man. That's weird. Look at her! This isn't any fun at all. <laughs> oh my god, I wanna go home. Look at her! So she wants to cry. She wants to run away so bad. And the old guy just smiling while chasing him. <laughs> chasing, chasing her. <laughs> this is so wrong in so many levels. Don't do this again, Konami. <laughs> well, I mean, they haven't been really successful anyway anymore. Ahem. She doesn't seem to like that. No shit, she doesn't seem to like that, Thomas. Let her go, okay? Look at look at him. He already pulled out his spear and everything. Poor girl. <laughs> ho ho ho! It's rude to talk back. There's no way. There's one way to deal with that. Come on, boy. Take your punishment. What? Yep. Fight a one-on-one -on -one with him. God damn it. <laughs> Ho ho ho! I don't look kindly. What? I don't look. I don't look kindly upon pests who interfere. Ho ho ho! Did you think I would only defend? What? What the fuck is that mean? Uh, I'm guessing he's gonna attack. Either attack or defend. I'm gonna go ahead and attack. Oh, he does defense. I mean, that's. Ah shit! I need to increase my uh, Thomas's le weapon level. Looks like. Ouch! The pain. 
bring up the pain. I think he's hurt, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep attacking. Oh my god, Thomas. <laughs> Don't expect me to spare you. Alright, let's go ahead and dead blow here. Please don't counter. Okay, he doesn't counter. Good. <laughs> oh my god. Careful, careful, careful. Alright, I think he's gonna go defend, so I'm gonna go ahead and attack. Good. Because sometimes if you do dead blow and he, they do attack, they would counter attack. And in this game, they do that. They don't really in this game. Ouch! The pain! Alright, and attack again. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. <laughs> Ouch! The pain! I'm, I'm guessing he likes the pain here. <laughs> oh shit, he's berserk. I didn't even think you could do that. Don't expect me to spare you, boy. Okay, that's gonna be attack, so we're gonna go to dead blow. I warn you, I don't like those interfere who interfere. It's probably gonna be attack again, so I'm gonna go with death blow. Ah, okay, we're winning. Slowly we're winning. Careful, careful, careful. It's gonna be attack. I mean there's just gonna be defense as you said, so I don't pick defense. I mean attack. Ugh, I can't talk today. Ouch, the pain! No pain, no gain, bitch. Alright, one damage per attack. Yay. Oh my god, please attack and then I'll do a... Uh, stupid death blows to finish the shit. Oh, two bar. That's awesome. Death blow attack. Hellish heat. That's weird. Whatever. That's so predictable. He, he he immediately said death blow. I mean, come on. You would know that it's a fucking death blow. <laughs> Unless you can't read. Death blow attack. Ominous oceans. What? Again, why would you say death blow? <laughs> oh god, he's a weird one. Yep. Wow, no damage. I was expecting a damage here. Well, I guess not. I'm too good. <laughs> ah, I lost. Damn right you'll do. <laughs> you lose. Don't ever let me catch you trying to ch chasing another little girl, okay? Or boys. I don't know what are you, <laughs> what you are into. <laughs> I just you just remember, just remember this. Yes, the North remembers. I get it, Gil Gilliam. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Let me think of how to use how do you, how do you say her name here? Shabon, Sabon, Sabon. Okay, I'm gonna call her call her Sabon. You saved me. Thank you. Oh, poor kid, being chased by an annoying asshole. <laughs> Sabon. Are you alright? No, 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 no. I'm not gonna be fucking alright after tonight. <laughs> I'm okay. This person came to, to my rescue. Well, thank you for helping Sabon. I really appreciate it. And Topo here, big man who doesn't talk. <laughs> Uh, well, it was nothing. Yes, that's right, but... Hmm? A place to perform? Yes, we're not able to make as much as we used to anywhere now. We've been trying to find a good place to perform. See, this is how you want to play it, Gilliam. You have her chase you, not the other way around. <laughs> God damn it. But it's been difficult. And this is where you suggested her to come to my castle. 
Would you like to come to my castle? Lake Castle? Let's see, it may be worth going people... It may be worth going. People do gather there. No, not really. After all. <laughs> Alright, we'll go to the Lake Castle. Thank you very much for telling us. You're welcome. Nay has joined. Alright. Topo. And... Shabon. Sabon. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce your names. I apologize. Alright, next one. We're gonna... Go into down here. First, I need to sell Sunbeam Rune to get some money because I need to. I need a twenty thousand, I think, in order to recruit that person. Twenty thousand potch. Just horseshit, my opinion. <laughs> what do you have? You have nothing. All right, I'm gonna sell a bunch of these. Worn up rope, old tunic, iron shield. Don't want to sell you. Whoa, twelve thousand. Okay. Now we're talking. All right, let's talk to this guy first. This is where. This is what we needed. The uh, rose brush. For his name is Augustine. As you can see, he's a narcissist. Like, like Vincent, Simone, yeah, Milich, yeah. He's one of those guys. <laughs> Narcissus. The world is beautiful. No, the world is a vampire. <laughs> Don't you think? Not really. I hate the world. The world sucks. Ah, uh, yes, yes. Um, do you like the sea? <laughs> Don't get me wrong, he may be Narciss, but he's actually really, really strong character if you actually level him up and give him a good skills and level his skills, he's actually really good. I used to have him on my group uh, back when I first played through this, uh, completed this game as, a, as Ghetto. Yeah, he was actually in my group. He's really good. <laughs> I suppose. I like things that are elegant and beautiful. Huh. It was fate that brought us together here. I feel it. And because of that, I'll show you my gorgeous rose brooch. This is my favorite rose brooch. Huh? Ah! It's gone! I can't find it anywhere! <laughs> no! How could this happen? Oh, cruel world! Is there no justice in you? There's nowhere, uh, there's no way justice exists in this world, in this Suicoden world. <laughs> <laughs> I like the touch that of, uh, when Gilliam was running. <laughs> Alright. We got your shit, don't worry. Please, let me be alone while I try and deal with this calamity. Oh, how could I lose my rose brooch like this? You present rose brooch. Yay. Eureka! You found it. Thank you so much. This is my rose brooch. My pride and joy. My prized possession. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. How can I ever repay? Oh, come to think of it, did you call on me because you had some business with me? Yes, I'm here, I'm here to recruit you. No, you kind of stood out, so I'm putting a group together, yeah. I'm actually trying to put a group together, uh, and I'm looking for members. Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh. I see. Well, there's not much I can do to prevent people from wanting near, near them. I'm like a magnet. Yeah. <laughs> Check magnet or a uh, man magnet. I don't know what you call man magnet. I don't know. <laughs> no matter how hard, no, no matter how hot, how I try to hide it, my pre my precious aura shines through like gl like a glowing rainbow. Okay. Red flag, <laughs> huh? The way I stand, the way I walk, perfection from head to toe, with a, with not a single wasted move. You must agree. I just have an unbearably clean and artistic portman 
Yep, that's how you fight. He's actually really good. Again, I said that many, 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 many times. And Thomas is, is a lucky boy to have him recruited. <laughs> I was gonna have Chris or Hugo the, or Ghetto to recruit him, but then again, having him in Thomas's group is actually it's actually much more make it more easier. I have, like him, Mel, just pretty much carries you through the end game of Thomas. <laughs> And you recognize it. I admire your taste. Uh, well, um, I'll never be able to match your refined taste. So you have one up, uh, one up on me. Plus, I owe you for finding my bros roast brooch. So I would be happy to join your group. Uh, thank you very much. Oh, I nearly forgot to introduce myself. My, I am Augustine, Augustine, Nab, Nabor, Nab, Neighbor, I guess. Fuck it. My special features are my mustache, <laughs> my rose brooch, and of course, my aura. It's, it's a pleasure to meet you. By the way, where is your entourage? I'm dying to meet them. They're at the lake castle. Why don't you come with me instead? Oh yes, I've heard of lake castle. Well, see you later. I look forward to meeting your people at the castle. Don't get lost. <laughs> Augustine has joined the 108 stars. Yay. Alright, the next one is this guy. Yo, old man. Dominic. Well, well, interested in my wares? You obviously appreciate their, artist, their artistic value. Not really. I follow it. I might be able to judge. So you say you know art. That's something in itself. For example, what do you? What do your eyes make of this mole armor? Fuck! It's forty thousand. Are you serious? Well, it's my finest masterpiece. Are you reaching for your money? Are you? Or aren't you? Uh, really, fucking forty thousand. Uh, fine, I'll buy it. I'll purchase it. I, uh, a discerning patron I'll always chooses the best. I don't meet many people with such an eye for value. Here you are, mole armor. I'm gonna sell it after this. If they only cost you five thousand, I'm killing you, Dominic. <laughs> I like you. People of your kind, uh, people of your kind, are a bit easier to do business with. Perhaps I could get you to come to Lake Castle. Many people come there to sell their wares. Lake Castle? You don't say. That sounds good. Sounds fantastic. Actually, I don't want to sit in this dingy old shop until I wither and croak. I just, it's decided. You're my last customer here. Yeah, you took my fucking forty thousand. Fuck you. <laughs> no, give me my money. Give me my money back. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> I hope this works out. You better be. Took my money. Can I sell it? Step right in and welcome. God. Oh, wow. Only 20,000. <sighs> it's not bad. At least I can buy something later. I think I need to buy something from the trader shop. Do they have a trader shop here? They do. Ooh. All right, I need to buy grape. Excuse me. Oh, hi you. Do you have grape? You do. Thank God. I don't have to walk all the way anywhere. I need that for to recruit certain someone in XA village in fact you know what I'm gonna go ahead and see you in XA village but I'm, I'm gonna bring Augustine Augustine with me so I'm gonna see you then I'll see you in XA village later all right here we are in XA we're about to recruit the last two characters the of Thomas's chapter I should say so we started here in the item store now that we brought Augustine with me and he's level 22 so and that's actually strong enough to beat anyone 
<laughs> I'm serious. Alright, so if we talk to Gordon here, your level of social refinement is noteworthy. The same cannot be said of the others. What do you mean? I I Oh right, that's right, right. Forgot I need to remove Mel. Damn it. Okay, you know what? I'll be right back. Alright, we're back here again. This time I brought all mail. Jeez. <laughs> He's really into all mail, huh? Okay. There you are. There you go. Well, look at this. Most excellent. The finest of gentlemen. <laughs> Yuan is finest gentleman. <laughs> I hope you all, yeah, I hope you will add me to your elite group. Absolutely. <laughs> Lucky stars. What should be the first order of business for me? Lake Castle. Right, I'll leave at once. Pardon me. <laughs> so he's gonna open up a item store for us. Oh my god. Truly majestic. You are. <laughs> I can't, man. I can't. I just can't. <laughs> when I first played this game, and I was like... Seven. No, wait, no, no. I was nine or ten. No, nine, nine, nine. Yeah, I was nine. And when I was recruiting him, I don't understand. I didn't understand it quite a bit. I was like, why do I need to bring all male? <laughs> oh, that. Okay. No, but over the time, over the time, I grew up. Uh, started playing again every year. I'm like, oh, I now I understand everything. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the next guy is this guy, the guy with the hoe. <laughs> Look at those fields to the east. Beautiful. I'm proud of those fields. They glow better than anyone. Oh, right. I need to. I'll do it in chapter 2 of Thomas, I should say. So, I guess that's it. That's. I guess Gordon is the last one to recruit. Yeah. Okay. So, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and end the part here. I forgot that there is something there's something going to happen in this town in the small village uh, and bards over there will will be able will be available to recruit so I'm not gonna tell you what happened in this town in the city and in in this village that's gonna happen in Chris chapter 2 which we're gonna go play after Thomas chapter 1 actually I'm not gonna go play chap Thomas chapter 2 right away because there's gonna be some revealment right later on if I play chapter 2 of Thomas. So I'm gonna play Chris and then Hugo's chapter 2 after that as well. And after that, yeah, we'll go back to Thomas. We'll see if Ghetto lasts. <laughs> so you know what, I hope you guys enjoyed, enjoyed this episode and I hope to see you guys very very soon. Stay tuned and stay safe. Later! Mm -hmm.